on everybody? How you doing today? Here I am with my buddy Danny Bravo. LBC Rec 562 is his YouTube channel. Highly recommend you check it out. Got some great stuff on the channel. And we are walking around Compton today. We are going to go check out Dr. Dre's Childhood Home First, Easy E's Childhood Home. And we're also, uh, I think we're going to find maybe a mural or two. I don't know what we're going to find in this video. But this is also a filming location. They filmed straight out of Compton at Dre's actual childhood home. And it's right to our right. This is awesome. Dr. Dre's in my top five artists of all time, easily. I'm a big Dr. Dre fan, so this is just a huge thrill to come out here. And uh, yeah, it's just right up here. We already passed it. It looks exactly like it does from the movie. And Dr. Dre actually lived here too. So it's a filming location, and we're one of the greatest, the greatest hip hop rap producer of all time grew up. The greatest? Well, I would say so, yeah. Yeah, you better say so. <laughs> you have to say so. Yeah, he is. All right, let's go. This is it right here. This is Dr. Dre's childhood home. Really, really cool. So he not only did he actually live here, like I said, this is actually from straight out of Compton. Gets kicked out of the house, comes right down this way. Really awesome to see. Dr. Dre lived here. There's another shot of the house right there. She gets kicked out, he brings his box of records and he comes right up this way. But I'm more focused on the fact that he actually lived here. That this is Dr. Dre's childhood home. Wow. Yeah, there's our shots of the street from this way. I'm not sure what, what he drove up this way or that way. He drove that way. Oh, yeah, there's the house right there. All right, now let's go find something else. Not to do with Trey Lacan, but happening with NWA, Hip Hop Pioneers. The best hip hop group of all time, NWA. Dre formed his early beats in this house. So just while we're making the video about Dr. Dre and Eazy-E, I thought I'd stop by and show you. This is uh, Kendrick Lamar, hip hop superstar. One of my favorites, Kendrick Lamar. This is his childhood home. I'm not sure who owns the home now, if his family owns it or not. But uh, yeah, this is where Kendrick Lamar grew up. Humble, one of my favorite songs of the past 10 years, easily. Uh, but yeah, this is right here from the album, Damn. Oh, it's such a good album. He's uh, Dr. Dre's protege, Kendrick Lamar. And he's in, uh, the Berserk video with Eminem, he's good buddies with Eminem. So if you're good buddies with Eminem, you're kind of good buddies with me. Yeah, no, I love Kendrick just for his music alone. But right there, Kendrick Lamar's house. All right, while we're on our way to uh, Easy E's house, I'll uh, stop and show you this. Oh, usually I do a big reveal like this. But I was already showing you. Here they are, NWA, right there. How cool is that? I read that it's a, uh, uh, there's a few murals, like, there's murals everywhere in LA of various artists. And I heard that there was an NWA mural, but I think it was a different one somewhere. But this is the one I had also read about, so I knew it was on the way. I love it. Love it. What do you think, Danny? Fucking amazing. Yeah. <laughs> that looks so cool. All right, let's go to Easy's -E's house right now. All right, so here we are. Where are we? We are in Compton. Whose house are we outside of? We are outside of ECE's childhood home. That's right. ECE's childhood home is right here. And uh, his family still owns it. Yeah. Lil ECE, who's an amazing rapper. Get back to me, dude. I'm trying to get a hold of you. Um, it's ECE's uh, wife still lives here. And I think he's. No, yeah. I think moved, I'm not sure, but Easy's mother owned this for a long time. Yeah. So I'm not sure, but I know, we we do know that uh, the family still owns it. I'm not sure exactly who lives here now in the family, but the family still owns it. You can see the basketball net in the backyard. There's some pictures of them playing uh, Lil Easy, his son, and stuff. And the, right near the garage, the garage is what I want to show you, because the garage is where NWA first got started, right here. And they just recorded a music video that Lil Easy did and it was, in this house. In it, in it ain't over. Is that the song? Was that the I one? That's the I think one that's the song. song. Yeah. Okay. Mr. Criminals has something to do with it. 
So cool. Look at this. This is Easy E's childhood home right here. Still owned by the Wright family. And there it is right there. So I I love seeing celebrity childhood homes, uh, celebrity homes, but it's that garage. That garage is where NWA first formulated. That's where they first, Dre and Easy came up with beats and started working together. Right there. And Dre often slept in there. He would sleep over and he stayed there in the converted garage. Isn't that cool? Yeah, there's Easy's house. Danny's been out here a couple of times before for his channel. And uh, he actually went to his, you went to his Easy, a little Easy show, eh? You, uh, sorry. I'm sorry, I interrupted your channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yet. interrupt your channel for me to ask you a question for my channel. You just <laughs> saw Lil Yeezy in concert not too long ago, right? A show yeah, about they, a, they, before they, the pandemic. He, no, it was actually during the pandemic. Uh, there was not a lot of people, but... So, so it was the social distancing. Yeah, it was and, all the social distancing. But yeah, he did a, a good show and he was actually singing ECE's uh, music. Yeah, we were talking about that the other day. It's good, nice. like which is cool. He's the son, why can't he? And the, you way, know? the way he raps, the way he moves, it's like I was looking at ECE. That's crazy. crazy. Yeah, we both follow his Instagram. You don't follow Lil ECE, you should. And I got his autograph. On a, on a, on a hat, right? <laughs> yeah. I want his autograph right here. Yeah. But yeah, that's that's just so crazy. That's just so crazy. So that basketball, and what's interesting is, uh, his gravestone, uh, Easy. Sorry, I'm getting confused now. Easy's gravestone has been changed to a new one, which I've I've either either already uploaded that video or it's going to be the next video. Uh, the original gravestone is in the backyard now, right? Yeah. The original. He, he actually got the old one, brought it to the house. Yeah, it's in the backyard, and I can insert a picture of that. So I've been to that one. We were together for that. Yeah. And uh, it's in the backyard now. You can see the picture on, on Lil Easy's Instagram, or you yeah. can put it up as Yeah. Picture. Very cool. And it's very sweet, too. They, they put it in the ground. There's, like I said, the basketball court in the backyard, and they're just hanging out. You can just imagine Easy up and down these streets. It's a, it's a nice little, nice little area. Nice and peaceful, quiet. Yeah. So quiet. Yeah. So there you go. That garage fascinates me. Just fascinates me. They got pictures up. They've got uh, stuff up there about Easy's career. Um, and it's heavily guarded. So just when I say that, I should be clear that it's heavily guarded and monitored but yeah we're trying to get in touch with both of us trying to get in touch with Lil Easy because he's met him a couple times and he's in Cleveland right now sadly well I'm hoping he's having a great time so sadly for us but great for him he's uh doing his thing working away Lil Easy oh, wow Y estuvo chingón el evento, uh, pude lograr que me firmara una gorra, me regaló una gorra y la neta chingón se portó el vato, mis respetos para toda la familia ECE, uh, Wright Family, gracias por todo lo que nos dejó el padrino del gesto, la verdad, mis respetos porque son gente bien humilde que se codean con toda la gente, entiendes, tengas feria o no, los güeyes all right so i was filming you talking so i understood, <laughs> I understood easy e right family gangster rap uh, and uh gracias what, what <laughs> i caught that much so you and you're talking about mr criminal the producer he's or the other rapper is mr yeah. criminal rapper or producer he's, he's a chicano rapper okay uh, mr criminal he's kind of like mr capone yeah maybe around the same level if not mr criminal is a little bit more than him so he's um, working now with, with he's Lil working Easy. with uh Lil Easy. eric Wright jr I think they yeah. signed a contract i don't know what that contract has to do uh but i think uh Lil Easy signed them into rich and ruthless if i'm not mistaken so they're going to be working together yeah. and i was just talking about that they film a video uh music video called it, it ain't, ain't over Red. yeah i just watched and it last week this house so it's still owned by the family. Yeah, yeah. So that's what you were saying. Okay, yeah. cool. All right, 
right there. That's Easy E's house. I keep, what am I saying? I think the heat is melting my brain. That's Easy E's house and the Wright family house. And that garage right between us, that's where NWA got started. What? I've taken you inside the studio where they record Straight Outta Compton. I did that like two years ago. Watch that video. video. Thank you. I don't even know if anybody watched it. I can't remember. I did. Thank you. <laughs> there, it's got one view. So I went into the studio where they record Straight Outta Compton. Check that video. Link below. Link below to Danny's channel, LBC Rec 562. Subscribe to mine. Like and subscribe. I always forget to say that. There it is. All right. Easy's house. Let's go. We're done for the day, are we? No, we're going to film something else, but for another subject. But for now, peace out.